Hi everybody, it's Jackie again. Here we are another week. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. I don't know what to say. <laughs> but I can still laugh about it. <laughs> Things are uh, pretty hot and heavy out there, aren't they? Um, you, know, you know, today's word from Mahay is, Lord Mahay is uh, harmony. Because this is what we're going to strive for. Harmony between us. There's so much strife, so much um, indecision. You know, there's, there's so much confusion about what is truth and what isn't the truth. And so people are getting very, very confused um, and, and let down a lot of really uh, strange and interesting paths. Um, and unfortunately, some of them are are not to their benefit. Some of them are dangerous as we have this virus out here. Um, but, you know, that's the course that we take. We all have our journeys to make, right? So we have to honor each other, respect each other, um, and, and know that even if we disagree with the other person, that that other person is doing the best that they can. And all we can do is be the light. All we can do, where are we? The little light seed. You have to be the light seed. That's all you can do. So if you find yourself, um, I know what's right. I know the truth. <laughs> I don't know if you do or you're not. It doesn't really matter at that point if you're right or wrong. You know, and Mahay is a big one to talk about that. It's not about right and wrong. It's about bringing that harmony bringing that energy and bringing that love into the planet because it sorts itself out in the light. If you try to do it from here, it's not going to get it. You know, we're always going to have this conflict. It's always going to be adversity. Um, my way, your way, my God, I don't even get that. But anyway, you know, it's always going to be that strife, that human conflict. How did Einstein say it? You cannot solve the problem at the same what? Vibration that it was created. This is Pat's lines, huh? You know, so we have to come from a different vibration to solve this conflict. We will not solve it with 3D thinking. We have to shift our minds and shift our energies. It's not about who's right or wrong. If that were true, Earth would be a very different place than it is. It takes the light to sort it out. So it's not about watching a YouTube video and going, oh, my God, this is the truth. This is what's going on. Or, oh, my God, this is so horrible. I can't stand it. Forget about it. It's never going to solve the problem. The only thing that will solve the problem is if we come from our hearts and we come from that light and we just put out that energy of harmony of love, of peacefulness. So that's what we're going to work on today. All right. That's what our goal is. And, and really, you know, COVID is becoming such an interesting growing tool for all of us. You know, our, the little Johnny Light Seeds are getting some fertilizer, right? So we are really getting in there and honing our skills and using our tools to be the light workers. So if you find yourself getting agitated, like, um, I know the way, or how can they be so stupid, or any of those things. It, it's not going to get you there. Then you're off in 3D again. You're not, you know, you're in your head, you're in your mind, you're not in your heart. You have to come from your heart, because in your heart, you don't say that. You don't feel that. You honor, you put that light out, and you let the light sort it out. And that's what we need to do. And we need to right now become masters of this. This is our task. This is our challenge. So see, I have my tourmaline again, and I'm ready to bring us into the earth and do that. So visualize that light, that warm, gooey light coming from the source, right? Let the Father just fill you with that strength, 
with that energy, with that courage, and bring that all the way down through your body. Oh, good. And bring it all the way down into your legs, into the earth, and let the mother grab on. And she says, hello. And she says, welcome. And you're grabbing onto that grid system now. Hmm. Feels good to be anchored. Feels strong. Now bring that light back up your back. And this is the mother energy, the nurturing. And it's still that gold, yummy light. And it brings you up. And it's nurturing. And it's soothing. And it's calming. And it brings up all the way up into your head and back to the source. Good. And we bring it right back down again. That strength, that courage. Right into the earth, to the mother. And the mother shoots it right back up. Up your spine. Up the top of your head. Back to source. And down again. And blow out now as that light comes down. All of your frustrations, any anger, frustration, anything you've had all week. Bring that right on down into the earth, into the grid. And now feel that harmony and that love and that nurturing from the mother. And now bring it back up and let it fill all the way up. And let it fill your heart. Feel it fill all through your chest. Oh, feel that love. Let it grow. You can do this. This is our job. Now bring that light all the way up from the back of your head and back to the source. Good. Good. Now do it again. Bring it down. Feel that. Fill your body. That strength. Bring it down in. And the mother brings it back up. Up your back. And feel that knowledge. Feel that nurturing. Feel that knowing. As you feel that heaven and earth connection. That father, mother, God connection. That you are that child, that go-between, between heaven and earth. So needed, so necessary, so wonderful. Now open your eyes as you feel that light. With your eyes open now, bring that light down, all the way down. And feel it with your eyes open, push right out your feet into the earth, into the mother. Grab on to that. Grab on to that light. It feels good. You feel safe. I'll bring it back up the back of you. And it comes up fast once you get used to it. And it just keeps going whoosh, right around, right around. Now you're a walking, talking light. And when you come from that in your heart, you will not come from those places of frustration. You come from harmony. You come from peace. You come from love. And this is our job. So all of the stuff that's out there, whew, there's a lot of it. And it's hard sometimes not to get caught up in it because it's meant to make you emotional. That's the goal. Because when you're coming from that emotion, you're not on center. You're not doing your job. They won, whoever they is, right? So, but our goal, we know, is to be the light. So what a great time to be here as a star child. What a great time, because now we're not talking about the future. We're not talking about stuff. You know, I started talking about transition when I was 10 years old. 
talk about it getting tiresome. <laughs> but it's now. It's now. We're here. This is the day. This is it. And that is what is being asked of us. To shift our energy. To be the light seed. Not Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. But 24-7. And when you have an oops, it's okay. Just bring that light back in. Just plant yourself again. Tether yourself again between heaven and earth. And be the light being that you are. I love you all. And I will see you next week. Bye-bye.